Cascade cast iron style rainwater and soil systems achieve the full appearance of cast iron with all the benefits of modern plastic materials. Suitable for refurbishment and new build projects, Cascade is quick and easy to install with everyday DIY tools. Step 1. Planning and Preparation Plan your installation carefully. Brett Martin offers product and installation advice every step of the way. Be sure you have the right tools for the job and relevant personal protection. For this new build project Cascade 112mm round style gutter and 68mm round downpipe in classic black is being installed. Step 2. Fitting running outlets. Fix running outlets above the drains or gullies where the water will drain into. Use 25 by 5 mm corrosion resistant screws. Do not use countersunk screws as this will restrict thermal movement of the fitting. Step 3. Calculating fall. To allow good steady rainwater runoff, cascade gutters should be fitted at a downward fall towards the running outlet, 1 mm for every 600 mm. The running outlet should be at the lowest point on the gutter run. Step 4. Fitting fascia brackets. Fix the first fascia bracket furthest from the outlet at a position on the fascia to allow for the required fall, no more than 150 mm from the end of the fascia board. Stretch a line taut between the fixed running outlet and fascia bracket to establish a straight gutter line. Fascia brackets should be fitted to the fascia board at equal intervals, where two gutter lengths are to be joined. A union bracket should be fitted in place of a fascia bracket. Gutter support should be spaced no more than 900 mm apart or less than 600 mm in areas of heavy snow. On internal and external angles, fix fascia brackets no more than 100 mm from the edge of the gutter angle. Step 5. Cutting gutters. Cascade gutters and downpipes can easily be cut to length using a saw. Use a file to remove any burrs from the sawn ends. When cutting the gutter to size, make allowances in length to fit to the expansion lines which are marked in the fittings. Step 6. Fitting the gutter. Lubricate the seals using silicone spray lubricant. Each length of gutter should be placed into position with the back edge under each fitting. Rotate down and then click front edge of fitting into place over the top edge of the gutter. Step 7. Fitting downpipe. If required, fit an offset between the running outlet and the downpipe. Fit the downpipe to the offset. To allow for expansion, ensure each connection is retracted at least 5mm from the receiving socket before fixing to the wall. Use a spirit level to check the vertical alignment. Mark the wall using the holes in the lugs of the socketed downpipe as guides. Then drill, plug and fix the downpipe using cascade lug fixings. Hoppers add architectural interest to downpipes and can also be used to allow more than one pipe to run into one downpipe. These are usually wall-mounted using the pre-drilled side lugs. Downpipe clips are normally fixed at downpipe centers and where required to give support. For this project, a plinth offset and 75mm offset are needed to follow the contour of the lower wall. Finally, a downpipe shoe is fitted to the end of the downpipe and secured to the wall through the fixing lugs. Water test the system to ensure no adjustments to fall are required and that all connections are fitted correctly. Check the Cascade cast iron style system at regular intervals to clear any leaves or other debris which may build up. Brett Martin Porcupipe can be inserted in Cascade gutters to prevent leaves from gathering in the gutter. Cascade cast iron style rainwater and soil systems are available in a wide range of gutter and downpipe profiles, with complementary period accessories and soil system, and available in a choice of heritage colours. Further details can be found at www.brettmartin.com.